doubting faith. That's what I read in the Gospel of Mark parallel to this. Now look at the situation. These nine guys, I don't know how long they tried to heal the boy. I don't know what gyrations they'd been through in prayer and everything else, but they'd been ineffective. He was still epileptic. He was still demon-possessed. And, and the other gospel tells us he couldn't speak and he couldn't hear. He was the only son of the Father as Jesus is the only son of God. A lot of parallelism there. And then we see they couldn't do it. And then they come and Jesus goes to the Father and the Father said, can you heal my boy? And Jesus in the other gospel passages asked, how long has he been sick? What's the nature of his ailment? And the father tells him. And then the Jesus says something to that dad that's rather remarkable. This is doubting faith, by the way. Jesus said, if you can believe, all things are possible. Now, if you'd been that dad, what would you have told Jesus? Oh, I believe you can do it. <laughs> I don't have any doubt about it. You're Jesus. No, 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 no. All of his nine followers had failed, perhaps over a period of time. And the father was honest. When you and I begin to try to deceive and lie to God, we're in monumental trouble. He said, Lord, I believe. I believe you need it. But help by now my unbelief. I believe you can do it, but I doubt it. That's what the father said. I doubt you can do it. So on a scale of 1 to 10, if a 10 was healing faith to the max, how much faith do you think that father had? think he had 6? Did he have a 4? I don't think he had a 1. I don't think he had about a point zero 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 five faith. Just a little touch of faith because he'd seen failure by the doctors, failure by the magicians, failure by the apostles, and now Jesus came, and he just had just a little bit of faith, but he was honest to, with the Lord. He said, do you believe? And he said, I believe, but I've got some big doubts. And in the next breath, bang, Jesus, heal the boy. Hmm. Jesus, heal the boy. And that Little bitty faith became mountain-moving faith. The boy was whole. 